It was this is hard pass, Kyle. Oh, yeah. This is hard pass. That's I'm going to give it up. Uh, Draft. Yes, sir. Your boy Drake, mm-hmm. Drizzy Drake Rogers. He dropped 100, 100 gigs worth of. What do they look for? <laughs> His last name, Graham. I was, I was just no, it's an old name. Uh, Wayne, Wayne, Wayne ah, called okay, him that. Okay, yeah. Okay. All right, good. Yeah, Aubrey Graham, K Dot's father. He dropped a hundred gr- <laughs> He dropped a hundred gigs of uh mu- music related content. Okay. okay. Out of those uh hundred gigs, I heard three songs. How, yeah. how much you have heard? It was only three songs. It was three songs. Yeah. What you think about those three songs? Uh one of them was cool. The other two, I, I'm not sure how often I listen to those. I 100 percent agree. And the song that was cool, that was uh up right, yeah, yeah, up. yeah, yeah. So with that being said, right, mm-hmm. I think Drake about to drop something. Yeah, I think he about to drop an album, and after he dropped the album, I think the beef is back on. And I ain't gonna lie to you, I think uh, Drake is about to end Kendrick Lamar career. Holy shit! The song is called Up for a reason. I think he dropped them three songs yeah. just so Kendrick could let his guard down. What was the name of the songs? Let's see. I don't know. I know one was called Up. The uh, up? other one had that uh, little Chinese-looking girl. Lotto? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but uh, but yeah, I, I think Drake about to drop, and I think it's over for your boy K-Dot, man. Uh, Y'all heard it here first. Because it was something like, it's up, mm-hmm. then it was like red light, green light, or something yeah, like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Red, yeah, yep. And and then the last one was called uh I can throw my phone. Home like Yeah, you know what? I forgot he said. It's up blue, green, red, housekeeping nose. Ah. Uh, you think that there's something there? With the titles? I I I think Drake about, about to spark things back up, man. Yo, Drake. Should I say it? Say it. Alright, I'm gonna say it and if it's too far, just uh bleep it out. Say it. Drake, listen to me. You had the angle. You had it, and you let it go. What you should have continued to do on mm. the hard part six when you dropped that after uh, Kendrick and uh, Dave Free showed that you know they out together, they they cool with each other, all of that stuff. You should have started calling him a god dog. You gotta bleep that word, by the way. I oh, don't you think, do? Yeah, I don't think you can say that on YouTube. Oh, okay. So, Drake, Dog. that's the angle. It's right there. You could talk about how Kendrick is in the corner while Dave Free. <laughs> <laughs> All right, never mind. He's right. in the corner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> hey, you stupid. All right, anyway. Uh, what was it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, he announced the, that him and Party Next Door are about to do a collab album. Oh yeah, he said that yeah on stage. He he came out at Party Next Door uh, concert and announced that they're gonna do a collab album. But that could be ten months from now. You know what I'm saying? I think. Hey. Excuse me. I think before that, he's gonna drop a solo joint. If if his next album is him and Party Next Door, yeah, cancel his career. Cancel it. <laughs> Kendrick won. He ducking. He ducking smoke. <laughs> He ducking smoke. <laughs> I, I don't think, I, I think it's pretty clear, unless we go into round two, it's pretty clear that uh, the general consensus is Kendrick won. Kendrick won. I keep fact. hearing people saying, right? All right. I keep hearing people saying that Kendrick won, it was a landslide, it wasn't close. In my opinion, it was, the, the, the ending score could have been 10 to 9 or 9 to 10. I, I think it was that close. I, I got the ending score being, uh, you know what? Go, go I got the end of score being nine to a nine. I do think I got it. I got it being ten to eight. But the only reason that I do is because Kendrick continued to do stuff while Drake after the heart part sick. He so he he kind of just went away and Kendrick shot a video, did a concert, stuff like that. That kind of you know made distance. I feel you on that. I think if you factor in everything after the fact mm-hmm. i can see where you got mm-hmm. that from mm-hmm. um the way i rated mine was i just went strictly yeah music i'm with you though because i at the end of the i was like and my opinion is tied but yeah i, I could see how yeah. that's a fact i could see how somebody could see it either way and you know yeah a, a few people most people saying uh kendrick won. yeah the general a consensus few people saying drake won. yeah yeah i do think kendrick had the best song and euphoria 
Okay. And okay. then I want to say uh, the most. Go ahead. I, 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 every time I listen back, I think I might like push ups better than uh, all of the songs except Euphoria. For me, I'm not saying that it's something that you got to think about or anything. Yeah. I'm saying for me, I think it's Euphoria, then push ups, and then Definitely. Family Matters for me, and then probably They Not Like Us. And then yeah, the rest of the stuff don't really matter. As yeah, much. I feel you on that. I think the most disrespectful song was "Meet the Ground." Oh yeah, yeah, you said that. So I think the most clever song was that uh, the one with Tupac and Snoop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But uh, but yeah, long. But story. see, th- th- that's why. I, and you know, a lot of people when I t- have this conversation with people, I'm like, "Meet the Grams." To me, it was like the heart part six. So if you cancel both of them out, I still got it tied. And that's yeah. the that's the part that I think uh, for for like. When when I talk to people about the 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 back and forth, I'm like, bro, when he dropped Meet the Grams, I wasn't impressed at all. And when Drake dropped the Heart Part Six, I wasn't really impressed either. Yeah. So it's like when he dropped They Not Like Us, I was like, okay, you you got something here. But when Drake dropped Family Matters, I was like, I remember listening. I remember the moment you sent that to me, and I pushed play on it, and I was like, oh shoot, yeah. And you see what I'm saying? But yeah. yeah. Uh, I seen somebody say um, Drake dropped the hundred gigs. They said Drake back. I don't think he ever left. I yeah, don't I think was about to say yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But um, I mean, general consensus is saying Kendrick ran away with with with, with, with it. Mm-hmm. The interview with uh Big Sean, yeah. he kind of alluded to the same thing. Mm-hmm. But I, whenever I, I I was listening to the songs. I factor out everybody else's opinions. Mm-hmm. It was just me and the music. Yeah. And I got it freaking tired. Yeah, same. That's same. just me. And uh, let me say this for the chat. <clears throat> Clear your voice. I haven't uh, liked a Drake album. I never listened to a Drake album more than once outside of... Nothing was the same? Nothing was the same and Take Care. Okay. And uh, Kendrick, I try listening to Kendrick music after the fact just to try to, you yeah. know, build... You know, just try to become yeah, yeah. a quote unquote fan, but yeah. uh, nigga, music trash. I'm gonna just Dang. Up, be honest. It, it's not my taste in music. Yeah, I was about to say that's what it you're supposed to say. I was uh, to I me, was, it's trash. I was at work with my homeboy, and uh, uh, he, I asked him, you know, I asked him a, about a couple things, and Kendrick Lamar is one of his favorite artists, and uh, mm-hmm. yeah, and and he um. He also told me that he he got a Nas as the goat, <laughs> and that made me say that I gotta ask you, what's your problem with Nas? Nas, yeah, trash. You think he just like Kendrick? No, Kendrick is better. Okay. I think Nas is trash. Nas is boring. <laughs> yeah, that's um, what he said. He his, said that his, people his, said his wordplay. I mean, he tried to have wordplay, but it's so simple that it's not impressive. Um, I don't even see. I don't even know how he got signed. Dang. He probably been doing some gotcha. nasty stuff. Gotcha. Well, let me ask you this before we move on. Go ahead. Do you think Nas uh, beat Jay-Z? I heard Ether was a classic. I listened to Ether, and I li- listened to TakeOver. Mm-hmm. Um, and apparently you're supposed to also listen to uh, Nas dropped something else, and uh, Jay-Z yeah. also dropped uh, I would have to something. On, it so, it's something on the blueprint where he said, is it? Uh, Uchi Wally at one mic. That's like the famous line or whatever. But, yeah, I got to yeah. uh, None of that back. Matters. I got to Back to Drake. Back. And uh, DJ Mustard went on a Twitter rant. Mm-hmm. Shout out DJ Mustard. And he said that uh, Drake... He said, Drake is the white people's Malcolm X. God, dog. And then he said... Uh, God, dog. He said that Drake got these bots out here like the Nation of Drizlam or something like God, that. God, dog. That was clever. <laughs> yeah, that but, was clever. Yeah, I, th- I think it was, too. That was clever. But yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, he uh, obviously is, uh, you know, an op of Drake's because he, he he made the They Not Like Us beat from Kendrick and, you mm-hmm. know, he went crazy with that. He uh, sold 18K, academics highlighted it, and DJ Mustard ain't like that. So, he went on Twitter and started going crazy. Because he sold 18K? He went on the the fact that academics highlighted it is what I think made him you know and he, everybody know academics his is, team Drake yeah 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 I feel like it's too much up in the air to say that beef is done oh yeah one hundred percent one hundred percent but see here's the thing right and I you know what back to push ups right mm-hmm. and even back to family drop, matters drop go ahead 
<laughs> I was off beat with no beat, but go ahead. <laughs> go ahead. In my opinion, right? Mm-hmm. Drake ate the field. That's a fact. He killed everybody except Kendrick. That's a fact. And I don't think the the thing with him and Kendrick is over. Go, Can I go stop ahead. you? Go ahead. I think he killed Kendrick, but I think Kendrick killed him also. I think because he was sending some shots at Kendrick that was fire. You know, and no, Kendrick responded with some fire. We, what I'm saying is, I think that it's it's, it's still there. It's not over. Nobody yeah. killed anybody yet. That's a they, fact. They it, it's still up in the air for who's going to really come out on That's top. That's a fact. But uh, ASAP Rocky done. Rick Ross done. Uh, the Weekend done. The Weekend Manager done. Everybody that he was talking about done. It, it, Metro done. He uh-huh. came with the little BBL drizzy thing. Didn't matter. <laughs> <laughs> I think that uh, Drake strategically was thinking about the 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 bigger picture. Years yeah. from now, let's say ten years from now, uh-huh. people gonna look back at the beef and say, "Yeah, Kendrick won, but Kendrick, but Drake was going against everybody, and they wasn't there in the moment to know that nobody cared about Drake going against everybody. That's a fact. We all wanted to see Drake, Drake versus Kendrick. Kendrick yep. Drake just kept throwing shots at everybody. Well, throwing his you know stuff at everybody else because mm, that's a fact. He knew down the line people gonna look back and be like, but yeah, but he was going against everybody. Though. Mm-hmm. I think that that was a little uh, master manipulation that he did there mm-hmm. because uh, it, it later on down the line. When the new class of people come up, mm-hmm. they're going to say, man, Drake got jumped and Drake held his own. And Kendrick was the only one that could nah, whatever. Yeah. But Drake, uh, you know, held his I own with that. everybody. I feel you on that. What you got to say about that? I feel like when it comes to that, um, and this is me, I'm 100% being serious. I'm taking all my all, 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 all bias out of it. Mm-hmm. Drake was fighting a losing battle from day one. Oh no, that's for sure. That's right. For sure. In my eyes, Drake is not. In my eyes, is not a landslide. I don't think so either. If we go Kendrick song for song, mm-hmm. Drake song for song, mm-hmm. we go bar for bar. Mm-hmm. Me personally, I got it tied. Yeah. Like I feel like if the fans take all the, the 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 bias out of it, yeah, I feel like they would um fences. Mm-hmm. If uh, but if Kendrick Lamar Font <laughs> would say that's the the, the, the the best smell in the world, <laughs> I'm dead serious. Dang. Like if, if he free if if, if Kid yeah. Font, yeah, his fans would say that's the best smell I ever smelled. Yeah, that's if if Drake so Font, they would say, man, he's sick. Shoot him yeah, or something. Yeah, you yeah. know what I'm saying? So I feel like if we take all the bias out of it, yeah, yeah. we just play this record. Then that record, this record, then that record, I and actually listen to what they saying. I feel like everybody or most people should have it way closer than what it is. Yeah, because it's not a, a, a landslide, and that's me taking yeah. my bias out of it. Yeah. That's like if I'm dissing you, and your your squad got six niggas in it, and y'all diss me. It's like nigga, if y'all win. This is a one on six. You're supposed to win. Yeah, right? that's what yeah. I'm saying, yeah. and I'm not taking sides. I'm just being honest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get what I'm saying? But um, I mean, hey, I do think Kendrick is better lyrically. Mm-hmm. I think I, Drake I agree. is better at making songs. I agree. I think you can market Drake better. Mm-hmm. I do think Drake is a more of a faker person. I think yeah. Kendrick is more of a real person. Yeah, I but, agree. Uh, I agree. But yeah, man. I, but that I, part don't matter when you said everything else because the whoever is a Kendrick fan, all they heard is the first stuff you said. They ain't heard nothing. Everything you just I know, said. That's a fact. The compliment Kendrick, it don't matter. That's a fact. <laughs> hey, it, 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 it's the truth. Yeah, though. Yeah. it's the truth. Now nah, I'm with you. I'm with you. It's the tr- la- last thing I'm, I'm gonna say. Right. Talk about it. That's like okay, Kobe and Shaq. Mm-hmm. Right, all the time. Who's a better player? Kobe, right? I would say Kobe. If they play one on one, but you can only score in the post, who's gonna win? Shaq, <laughs> easy. So Drake stepped into Kendrick's lane. Yeah, yeah. He was supposed to win. Yeah, true. And true. I'm not making no excuses for Drake. <laughs> yeah. Like I don't freaking get. My dog was J Cole. Yeah, same. Get what I'm saying? So. I was hype when he dropped something <laughs> in the drill. You. I was like, I don't care how bad it is. He dropped. That's that's <laughs> you stupid. But yeah, my my dog was J Cole. So what I'm saying is. I think that if Drake and Kendrick 
mm. were to do a battle like hit versus hit, mm. I Drake go win for sure. Yeah, because that that that's Drake's lane. Yeah, that's his field. Kendrick right? would be going into Drake's lane. At that's that a point, fact. But that's not what this was about. That's a fact. But I mean, and Drake went into Kendrick's lane. Yeah, shout out to uh, both of them boys though, man. I do respect K Dot more. Yeah, yeah, same, same. My love for Drake the same. Man. I still listen to Euphoria to this day. Mm-hmm. That's my sh dog. I feel you on that. Shout out Cut to the open. Boys, you got sh twisted. Shout what is it? The boys, braids? Man. Hey, you stupid. <laughs> hey, if I meet Kendrick, I'm going to go dap him up. Yeah. If I meet Drake, I'm going to go dap him up. Mm -hmm. If I meet J. Cole. You going to apologize When to he him? not looking, I'm going to go like that there. <laughs> But if he looking, I'm gonna be like, "Hey, <laughs> no!" Shout out to J Cole, man. I might cut that because he. I feel bad saying that. No, you supposed to meet him. You supposed to put your hand out. He shake it. Say, "Listen, man, I couldn't sleep these past." <laughs> <laughs> hey, drop down in the comments. Let us know if y'all think uh, Drake had anything to do with uh, DJ Mustard uh, sales getting Gordo to drop the same day. Also, you know, what else was it? What else? No, nah, that, that oh, was the 100 gigabytes it. joint. Yeah. yeah. What y'all think about the uh, three songs from the 100 gigabytes that uh, Drake dropped? And <laughs> yeah, I ain't even going to go where y'all at in the battle no more. Yeah, they are, yeah. That's a wrap. K-Dog won by general consensus. Yeah, general consensus, yeah. Yeah, that's it. Yeah.